Good afternoon, everyone. This new system will really help get information out there quicker in the case of an emergency. Now this final phase will run through August 12th, which includes updating old systems that have been around for over 10 years. Officials say the new system will provide a broader reach of communication and allow for better response time. Sirens will be activated several times throughout the county this week to make sure the new system works how it should. And there is no specific schedule, but officials say they hope that the community can be patient in this time of improvement. Sirens will start to sound in the northern parts of the county and move to the south in a way you can stay up to date on severe weather in Clinton County is by signing up for rave alert and those links are on our website. We have three towers in our county but now when we hit the edges of our county we can also pull in service from the other towers surrounding. It has improved our coverage area in those outlying areas that maybe our towers weren't actually reaching as well as they could have so now we can pull in um, coverage from other counties and improve the the safety of our responders. Now, if you aren't in Clinton County, we do have QR codes up on our website that you can find the most updated severe weather in your area. Here for you live in Clinton County, Autumn Pitcher, 6 News.